Daniela. Congratulations with all your projects. You're you're going ever since you entered English cinema, you're going from one blockbuster to the next blockbuster. Suicide Squad, Guardians of the Galaxy 3 last night, and now Fast X. Congratulations with all these Thank projects. You. Thank you so much. I'm very excited. <laughs> <laughs> I I bet you when you entered uh, American cinema, you didn't expect your your career journey to be like this. No, and I didn't know how fun uh, it is to to shoot movies with like blue screens and tennis balls and everything. Actually, I remember when I was still like self taping from Portugal, I I would comment with my uh, agent from Portugal like, yeah, the, those are, are the maybe the the only kinds of movies that I can't imagine myself doing because it's like acting with a wall acting with a puppet and out of nowhere I'm doing it and I'm loving it <laughs> and it's amazing those are like the most fun movies to shoot for real most excellent I would love to talk about those movies but we have to talk about Fast X so tell us what drew you into Fast X oh my god uh so basically uh I read the script and I loved Isabel. Uh, I've always been a Fast Saga fan. Uh, first, when I was younger, for me, it was about like watching people race, watching people like um, not argue, you know, but like challenge uh, each other. I would love to, I love to see their like outfits, to listen the, like to the cool songs and everything. Um, but then as I grew up, it started to be more about like family, uh, those values, friendship, union, and, and yeah, and as soon as I got the invite to, to be part of the family, I didn't think twice. I was going to say, you must have been fairly young when you were introduced to uh, Fast and Furious. Yeah, th that's what I'm saying. Like in the beginning, I didn't understand what I was watching. But then as I grew up, I was like, mm, okay, this is interesting. This is, yeah, more than just cool. So when you were introduced, you were introduced to the street racing and ironically, that's the scenes that you are in for this Fast X. Yeah, I remember watching Suki. She was my favorite character. And now I can be a kind of a Suki. It's amazing. I love well, it. Tell, tell us about the character that uh, you, you're, you're, you're about to play, Isabel, who is, a I want to say, a Brazilian street racer. Yeah. So she has a, a strong connection to Dom's past. She's in a lot of pain and just meeting Dom and uh, connecting also with Dom will heal a little bit of that pain. Uh, I can't say why, but you'll find out. Uh, but basically, yeah, she's a badass. I'm very proud to be the only girl in the race, but like against the boys. Um, and she's from Rio. She's a self-made street racer. <laughs> And yeah, and she's pretty cool. How relatable is it to play oh, a Brazilian character? Yes. I mean, uh, as a Portuguese person, uh, even my friend, my fans from Brazil, they've been saying that I'm the most Brazilian Portuguese <laughs> actress ever because I love their culture. I love their music. I love their uh, meme pages. Like all the uh, meme pages or even Twitter pages that I follow, like uh, humor related are from Brazil because I love their humor. Uh, so yeah, I was very, very familiar were, with the, the way they talk, the way they, they think uh, and everything. And it's not that far actually from the Portuguese people. So yeah, it was very fun to dive in into the Brazilian um, energy. Now, speaking about Fast and Furious, we cannot stop talking about the cars because the cars themselves are characters. Tell us about your partner in crime, the car that you get to drive in this film. Oh my God. Uh, so I have a yellow Datsun and it's really, really cool. And I'm very happy to, uh, I'm very happy for, to have uh, like the same yellow as the Brazilian flag actually. Um, it's the same yellow, it's really similar. Um, and yeah, and I was very excited. First, I was like, hmm, I should have something on my outfit that matches my car. But then uh, 
I was like, no, no, Isabel wouldn't do that. So <laughs> it was nice to have all that information even before shooting the movie and make those decisions and be very collaborative and thoughtful at the same time. And yeah, and I'm very proud of my car. I can't wait to share like a proper picture on my Instagram <laughs> next to my car. Well, t t tell us what was it like to sit in that car? It was very special. Like, I, I don't know a lot about cars, but once I'm in, in a special car, I can feel that I'm in a special car, you know? And and yeah, and um, it I felt just like a badass. It it helped me build my character, actually. So you could, could you, is it like a real car that you get to sit in or is it just a prop? Yeah. I mean, do, no, do no, you no, feel no. the vibrations, everything? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a real car. And I didn't have only one yellow car. We had a lot of yellow cars so we can use them like uh, to shoot the race, then to be like outside uh, at Rio. And then to have an, we had like, a, I don't know how to say in English, but like the same car with, with no doors and with no windows. So we can like shoot all the movements that the car does during the race. So yeah, I was very surprised that I didn't know that we would have so many cars for each character. So was this all practical? Was it, or was there a green screen or tennis yeah. balls? Or oh, of course, we had like blue screens and a lot of like light effects and everything. Um, but also we had um, the cars outside in parking lots and yeah we we got to to drive them oh my gosh wow i i am so excited for you because you get to race against vin diesel and jason momoa in in this scene yeah it's it's crazy i was i was very hyped to 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 shoot those scenes and now that i've been watching like the uh the trailers and everything and I watched the movie already I was like I, I can't believe if somebody told me like yeah in five years you'll be racing against Jason and Vin I, I would be like what no that that's not true that can't be <laughs> but now yeah it's real well let, let me leave with, with this one thought um I want to know because I mean speaking in the spirit of Fast X how do you drive? Do you do you sometimes like to drive fast like a race car driver or or you're or you're very cautious? Um so I would say that when I'm in the driver's seat, I'm more confident. When I'm next to the driver, I'm like, no, don't slow, slow down a little bit. But then when I'm the one driving, I I drive fast, but within the speed limits. But like, for example, if I'm heading to a meeting or going going out with friends or something like scheduled and I have a time to be there within the limit, I'm on the limit because like I don't have any time to waste. <laughs> Most excellent. Well, hey, it is terrific con conversation with you. I can't wait to see Fast X. I'm, I'm, I'm actually Zooming here from, uh, from CinemaCon and we saw preview and some of your castmates came out and the crowd is really pumped for uh, fast x amazing so good to know thank you so much well thank you and hey enjoy this life i mean you have you have too many blockbusters <laughs> more, more blockbusters than any other actresses out there right now so i don't know how you're pulling this off <laughs> me neither just keep working <laughs> <laughs> excellent next time i'm sure thank, thank you, you.